Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Soft Modern, and today I'm going to be showing you how to deal with a few issues when it comes to TalkBack and Explore by Touch on your Android device. Uh, if you guys aren't familiar with TalkBack, uh, what it does is it recites any actions performed on your Android device. Uh, this feature is primarily used by people with low visibility, people that are blind. Uh, to access it, you can just go to Settings, Accessibility, uh, scroll down services, talkback, and then just turn it on. So the first time you guys use talkback, uh, you'll be prompted with another pop-up like this. It's for Explore by Touch, which is a secondary feature to talkback. Um, what that one does is that instead of um, reciting actions you perform, it'll just speak on uh, any icons you tap on before the action is performed. So it's kind of like preliminary to talkback. Um, once you enable it, you can press OK, and Explore by Touch is actually the culprit for some of the issues that, that can happen, so I'll press OK. List showing one items. Disabled. Okay, I'm pressing OK. This enables Explore by Touch as well. You can't see it here, but it's, it's on right now. So uh, one issue that people have is um, bypassing the lock screen, so I'll show you guys. Touch with home. Loss and screen off. Ringer 70%. Okay, so as you guys can see at the bottom, it says double tap. It says double tap and then swipe the screen to unlock. Um, that's not actually true. If you guys try to do that, it, it doesn't do anything actually. So what you have to do is just swipe with two fingers. <laughs> okay, I want to stop talking. All right, and that's because of Explore by Touch. So on the Nexus devices, you can disable Explore by Touch, but it's only on the Nexus devices like the Nexus 4, the Nexus 7. Um, it's only those devices where you can disable Explore by Touch, which is what causes a lot of commotion with it. So uh, in the next part of the video, I'll show you guys how to bypass a lock screen when it has a pin code. Okay, so we're back. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so we're back. And uh, with the Note 2, it's kind of strange because you're supposed to um, hover, uh, tap on whatever number and then double click so that you can press it. Um, but instead here, you can just... You can just tap six, it like that. Six, six, and then uh, enter. enter device, and then you can enter the device. So that's not what's supposed to oh, Okay. Off. I'll turn it off. What's supposed to happen, I'll show you guys with the Galaxy S3, is you're supposed to hover over it and then double tap. And then double tap again. Whoa, let's see. And then double tap. Double tap. Well, I keep pressing five, okay. Double tap. And then double tap. And then when you press okay, you double tap on okay, and it should enter. So that shouldn't be the case. It, it, you should always be double tapping, which is kind of strange on the Galaxy Note 2. So uh, once you, uh, if you want to take off uh, TalkBack, which will take off Explore by Touch, you'll have to go to Settings. So you can tap on Menu and access Settings easily there. And if there's other devices like the Galaxy Tab, uh, you'll have to scroll from up here and go to the settings up here. So I'll just go from down here, like how I'm accustomed to. Um, you'll see that the yellow box forms around settings. That's the current, um, the current thing that you're selecting. So you just t press and then it'll select different ones. So once, once that's selected, you can tap twice anywhere and it'll select what, what's uh, inside of the yellow box. So I'll go into settings. I'll go down to accessibility, where we came from. And from there, I can go down to talkback, double tap, and turn it off. And talkback is off. Um, sometimes people have issues uh, with talkback because they turn it on accidentally or because they're me just messing around with the phone. So it's good to know uh, a few of these things before you attempt to mess around with your phone. Alright, well that's it guys. Uh, thanks a lot. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Soft Motor.